you know them as Lola and Arturo Rosales, brother and sister on CBS's The Young and the Restless. Them actually have some South Florida ties. We love that. This afternoon, Sasha Calle and Jason Canela are live in the CBS4 News studio. First of all, Merry Christmas to both Merry of you. Christmas. Glad you're home for the holidays, and I understand you. you celebrated together. You mixed the families together we this mixed year. The families. Yeah, it was really nice. Jason had us, so it was really sweet. Thank you. Aww. Yeah, we actually, uh, so while we were in LA, I came to Miami for Thanksgiving. You know, uh, Cuban moms would not have no, it any other way. No, unacceptable. <laughs> <laughs> and she actually spent Thanksgiving with Jordy and his family I in did. LA. Jordy, yeah, uh, brother. he plays um, Ray on the show. On the show. And so uh, we were all joking. We were like, all right, you can have the little sister for Thanksgiving, <laughs> and we're going to take her for Christmas. Split so, custody. Yeah, I like yeah, that. Custody. All right. Yeah. So 2018, obviously, a big year for both of you and for your characters yeah. on The Young and the Restless. Jason, let's start with you. Arturo, introduced to The Young and the Restless family this year. Just talk about what a year it's been for you and what fans can look forward to going into next year. Oh, man. It's it's truly been an honor, you know, to to join the cast and, and be a part of a show that's been going on for as long as it has. Uh, and also at number one for, for 30 years now. So thank you to the fans who tune in every day. We really would not be able to do this unless it was for you guys. So, um, I mean, that being said, it, it really, truly has been an amazing journey. And I'm really excited to go into 2019 with everything that they have planned for us. And, no spoilers? Uh, Nothing? No spoilers. No. It's going to be you crazy. I mean, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, well, they also, they just introduced Mia who uh, yes. is spicing things up on All the right. set with our family. And uh, Arturo's having a tough time trying to avoid her. So mm. it's going to be a lot of fun there. Scandalous. <laughs> All right. So the best part about those soap operas is that it's really go, go, go. You don't have to wait too long for that next spoiler because the next yeah. day there's an episode yeah. and it's really nonstop for all of you guys. So how has it been for you, Sasha, sort of getting acclimated to the pace of the soap opera lifestyle and just sort of adjusting to the scene on The Young and the Restless? Yeah, they kind of threw me in. Yeah. You know, they were like, you're hired and here's a bunch of work. And I was like, <laughs> okay, here's your brothers, and I'm like, hi, how are you guys? And then it was just like call action, and then you just did it. And I think it's a it's a practice, you know, you just go on set and you do it. And I have amazing co-stars that I work with, and I couldn't be more grateful, and they just make it so much easier for me. Yeah, talk about the family that you guys have going on. Seems like you've become sort of a little family off the set as well, but yeah. the Rosales family and sort of bringing in that Latino flavor to daytime television. What has it meant for both of you to be able to do that and to sort of show your roots on television? You know, uh, it's been, uh, I was talking about it the other day, I, I love that they don't really put such a, like, focus on the fact that we are Hispanic. You know, there's little things here and there, but it just, you know, we happen to be a Latin family that's now part of, of YNR, and I think that it's, they're doing it in such an organic way that I think that now in 2019 there will be opportunities for us to touch certain things, you know, that perhaps might shine more of a light on our culture. And, and that's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, it's the first integration yeah. of a Latin family, I think, in 45 years. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, so yeah, it's, it's, it's truly an honor and, and a blessing and a lot of yeah. fun to do it with and Sasha and Jordy. When we got cast, it was so amazing because we met each other and we we're like, wait, are we siblings already? <laughs> yeah. like, it was, the connection was insane. Yeah. It was like we had known each other forever. And then we're like, wait, we're all from Miami. So that was such a big thing. And when we're offset and onset, we're always like this. So it's really incredible. I mean, I spent Thanksgiving with Jordy and then I spent Christmas with uh, Jay. So it was really nice. So awesome to see South Florida yeah. represented. And of course, yeah. it comes on right after us here on CBS. Right. <laughs> Miami. You can watch The Young and the Restless right after CBS 4 News at noon. But really quickly, favorite South Florida holiday tradition that you guys were able to take oh, part in this year? Oh, my God. I think just just, just mama's cooking. Uh -huh. Mom, if you're yeah. watching, woman, Family. you're blessed. Yes. Uh, yeah. She packs them up for you to take back to L.A. when you I, go. No, can you imagine? Actually, every time she goes to L.A., you're it's lucky. like she freezes a butt, frijoles, everything. And then so uh, I have food it. for like a month. It's the best. But then it's gone, and, and I miss her, and I got to come back. So. There you go. All right. <laughs> Always welcome. Welcome back here, not just to South Florida, but right here to the CBS Miami Thank set. So Sasha and Jason, thank you so much, thank thank you, thank you so much for being here with us today. Thank you.